All right, well it's Friday at 5.30 and we've had an afternoon of a lot of rain. So unfortunately, uh, we've kind of missed out on a lot of the action. First round of qualifying, we're going to try to start here in about 15 minutes. Uh, this is something that we kind of messed up our evening show because the track, uh, the dew is probably going to fall early. So we're probably not, we're going to move our small tire, big tire racing into tomorrow and try to squeeze everything into a big Saturday show. But uh, we're going to make the best of the weather that we're given and we're going to go have some fun.
on here at Outlaw Diesel Revenge. Uh, we had decent qualifying. We didn't do anything great, I guess you would say. Uh, last night we put down two fairly solid passes. We weren't quite seeing the mile per hour that we were wanting. Uh, some of our times were a little bit off and we discovered last night that uh, one of our nitrous jets was not the size that we thought it was. So we got that changed out. We got the power back this morning. Had a really good 60 foot, went 110 to the 60, but the truck ended up driving left. So we had to pedal it a little bit and ended up going, I believe it was 443 this morning. Uh, so with the pedal, it's still a good time. You can tell the power's back. Everything from that department looked good. So we're just trying to make a few little adjustments, trying to make the truck go straight and see what we can do in eliminations today. one um, we pretty much went into it just wanting to put down a good A to B pass and we made a couple of decisions that uh, didn't work out so well I guess we we took a few RPMs out of the hit and the combination of that and the heat and everything our bump box decided to not work uh, it bumped in it bumped once and flickered the bulb but it didn't keep the second bulb lit and then it didn't want to bump again so we couldn't get in the second bulb in time and we didn't time out but we weren't able to get on boost in time so we were um, lost the first round so we're out of racing today it's a pretty big bummer for us all but we're gonna end up running the big tire class tonight so hopefully we can at least put a show on there uh, going up against gasser cars again so 
most likely uh, we're gonna have to throw a Hail Mary and see see what we can make stick. But uh, we're gonna make the best of it, have as much fun as we can, enjoy our friends and everybody that came out to support us, and hopefully still put on a good show. 50-50 arm length, $20 gets you 50-50 tickets for Dino for Dex. We sold $1,200 of raffle tickets so far, and we're gonna go get another roll and get a golf cart because my knees hurt. Oh,
Okay, we've concluded the Outlaw Diesel Revenge 2019. Uh, it was a great day today. We had absolutely perfect weather. Uh, Friday started off with rain. That was a little bit of a disappointment, but uh, today was redemption. We had literally perfect skies all day, perfect weather, and I think we had a great time. Uh, it's a busy time. I want to congratulate all the winners. Uh, we had three winners of the dyno competition, and we also had four winners of the show and shine competition, best Dodge, best Chevy, best Ford, and best overall. And then also to all the ODSS racers for the ET, and 770 winners and the 770, 670, 590, Pro Street, Pro Mod, and Top Dragster. Congratulations to you guys. You guys worked very hard and we're glad that you came. And thanks again to everybody that was involved from food vendors to the jet cars to the Blastro Van, all the guys that came in for just extracurricular activity. Uh, we had a great time and I think that really helps with the spectators. Uh, so I hope the guys that uh, came, if you guys came and watched this, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any comments or suggestions for us to make this event better, uh, leave it in the comments below. We'd be glad to revamp this, take your suggestions, and try to make this better because what we started with this year, we're going to try to make better next year. So thanks again for supporting the Outlaw Diesel Revenge, and we're going to do this, and we look forward to seeing you here in 2020.